Hey guys, uh, this is Debbie, another intro, <laughs> another Project Pan, um, this is Debbie, another Fantastic Ladies, um, Project Pan collab, um, this is called Blast Into Project Panning, and it goes from July 1st to January 1st, and this is a rolling project, and you basically I'm going to read from the post right here. Uh, it says, Pan 8 Makeup Beauty Products from the Colors of the Soul System. I actually have 9 products because Pluto wasn't included in the list. And I feel like Pluto should be included. There was a couple other people that are going to do Pluto as well, too, that was in the comment of the post from the group. So, I'm not alone with the whole Pluto thing. So, I do have, a, it's just a little mini right now but this is a rolling project so like if I use reach goal on something then I'll roll in something else um but yeah so I'll just start going through the the products first off is uh Mercury is I, I just wrote down the exact order of the list that she has so I'm gonna go from that Mercury is a uh, gray color so I have um from the, this is the Kylie Take Me On Vacation palette, and I put the gray in here. There's three eyeshadows um, in here that are in this project. So I put this gray color. I have it on my little lash line, and I put it through the crease mixed with the brown a little bit too. But yeah, this gray, and my goal is to hit pan on it, and then... So, yeah. And then, next is Venus, which is pale yellow, which I picked this Essence So Glow Cream to Powder Highlighter. I have this on a highlight, as a highlight today, and I have it on my inner corner. This is kind of harder to work with because it is cream to powder. My goal for this is to hit pan, as you can, like, there's a really, like, this glares so much because it's so... It looks almost white, but it like has that little bit of yellow in it. It's like very, very pale yellow. And like, so my goal is to hit pan, even if it's a little baby pan. Um, cause I like using this in my inner corners and sometimes I put it on my brow bone and stuff. So if I could just hit a little baby pan, that would be fine with me. And that's what my goal is for that. And the shade is look on the bright side. Um, these are discontinued though. Um, I think there was only two shades, anyways. But I'll just put whatever in the description. Uh, next is Earth, which is blue or white, and I got um this. This is the Lorac Pads of the Caribbean Demo and Tells No Tales collab, and this is the Ahoy Matey. I actually only have the gloss in this project, the, only the glosses that will be in this project. I am wearing the lipstick because I just couldn't figure out what lipstick to wear because I did my eyes using like all the eyeshadows like that in this project. But like my bra brain was like, you can't think of a lipstick so I'm just like, I'm just gonna throw this one on. But the gloss, the gloss is the one in the actual project. I would love to use this up. Um, let me see if I can... It doesn't settle. It's really thick. I don't know if... But as you can see, I think it's about half empty. Like, you could see that little window I just made with the wand or whatever. But I think it's about half empty. And I'm gonna make tallies for it. I'm gonna make tallies for... Not the eyeshadows. I'm not gonna tally the eyeshadows. Because the Essence Highlighter, I'm gonna tally every time I use it. And the Gloss So Fall. Fall. And then two other things that are also in this project. But only the glosses in the project pan. The lipstick, I'm not the, like, it's not counted, but the glosses. So, yeah. If I can get this used up, I would be so happy. So, yeah. And the next is Mars, right? Yeah, Mars. And that is reddish brown, which I have this shade 
like this mirror doesn't bend back very far. Okay, I have this brown shade. What do they, these have names, but they're not in the packaging. They're like on the back. But I'm just I just wrote it down as like Kylie VK warm brown shade. That's what wait. They're reddish brown. I was like, wait, am I on the talking about the wrong thing? But no, it's this shade, and I would like to hit like really big pan in this. I want to try to get as much use as I can out of this shade. If I could just get a huge pan in it, it will be amazing. So yeah, that's and that's the one I'm wearing in my crease. I have the gray blended into a little bit because I want it a little bit cooler but yeah that's the color in my crease right now the next we have okay uh jupiter which is white or orange and well technically the post says white and orange but i read it as white and or orange so i like this thing is white so I'm just uh so that's what I have for it so don't like cry for picking something that's not orange and white it just it's white it's good enough <laughs> but yeah this is the uh, the body shop Camille chamomile why did I say Camille like the glare is being really bad for some reason and it's like nine and glare is usually gone by nine um eye makeup remover and I have it here like I use this every time I remove my makeup I don't really like it um like it removes my makeup good I don't like the scent it, it smells weird so I will just like it's like right there though and I'm just gonna uh, keep mocking it so like it's gonna go down no matter what but if I could just finish this off really quick then that would be awesome if, I keep telling myself if, if I just wear more makeup, then I'll use it faster. So, yeah. That's what my goal is just to use this up, of course. Because I have. So it's like. There. But yeah. So well, that's the product for that. Um, the next is Saturn, which is pale gold. And. I have that with my one other, <laughs> I have one shade from this palette. This is the B by Bubs Beauty BH Cosmetics palette. I really like Bubs. I have her, I have a book right, right here. So I have her book. She's really nice. I watch her vlogs. So, um, I have, why did my screen go dark on my phone? I have the shade Hopeful. And my goal is to hit pan on it. It's what's on my lid right now. It's really pretty shade, but it's just a pale gold. Like these shades are kind of similar. I feel like this one is more pale, but I feel like this is more of a yellow, while this is more of a gold. I don't know what really c classifies yellow versus gold, but whatever. This is the sh shade I picked. It's called Hopeful, and my goal is to hit pan on it. So that's that. When I do um, update pictures, I'll probably just put these right next to each other open and just take a picture of the both of them in one picture so that I can do the least amount of pictures possible. Because I film this on my iPad and, and I don't want to just have, I want to make the least amount of space possible, like take up so I can film and alt edit and all that jazz. Or whatever. Okay. We're done with that one. Uranus is pale blue. And I have pet the shade, other shade. This blue, which is on this part of my little lash line. I blended the gray into it a lot. But yeah. So this blue, I want to hit pan on it. Like So this one and these two other ones in the project. So, yeah. So I want to hit pan on it. There's already a little bit of a dip going on. Like, the, these two have dips and, like, none of the other ones. This one has, like, pan in it. But, like, these two are the only ones that has, like, dips and stuff. So, 
but yeah I want to hit pan in it um what was I saying I really like this eye look I came up with though so I probably will wear this eye look again although I don't think the lips go with it I, I, I just don't really like the lips with it but like my brain was just blinking so it's like it's like whatever it's like it, it's okay it matches the little lash line the lips so it's like it's fine but I don't really like the lips with it um so next is Neptune which is dark blue oh these are the ones I'm gonna do tallies for this one so that this one is so Venus um with earth the eye pencil Neptune and then Pluto those are the ones I'm doing tallies for um where did it go it was actually on the other side of my table okay, I was like putting all the products on the table I like triple counted and I left it on the other side of the table oops okay this is um what what was this dark blue uh this is a color workshop eye pencil it doesn't have a name for the color it's a navy it's in my waterline right now and yeah so I want to use this 40 times that's my goal is to use this 40 times I kind of want to try to like do some really intense black liner and then like put this like right here because I I've been watching skins and like Effie did that with like some like green tealy one and I was like oh my god that's so pretty I should try to recreate Effie's look so I'm just like oh my god <laughs> like recreate her look <laughs> But yeah, so I want to use this 40 times. Um, I'm not including any of the times I'm wearing it right now on my face. Because I am filming this a little bit ahead of schedule. A, little, a couple days in advance. I'm not counting any of the times I'm wearing it right now on my on my tallies. But, um, but every time after I'm done, like, count. It's just, I, I don't know. I'm trying to get some things done right now. I don't know. I don't know how to speak, so if you like mumbling, don't know how to speak for people, I'm your girl. <laughs> but yeah, okay. And then the last one I have is Pluto, which I'm using like a little sample. That's what lots of people were doing. They were you doing samples? I was trying to look up the color of Pluto, but it wasn't like working out for me because Pluto, it wasn't like it wasn't a lot of information, and it was gonna be like brown again or something. So I have this. Well, it's actually a little Sephora sample, like the one that you go in store and like ask for. Okay, let me see. I'm not wearing this today because I wanted to. I'm trying to get a couple more uses out of my foundation that I'm for my one project pan right now for the end of the month so yeah I have this much I've used it probably about five times um so there's probably 10 to 15 more uses because most foundation samples usually last me 15 to 20 times on average I've only gotten like two two other ones or whatever but that's what usually happens. And this is the Laura Mercier Tinted Moisturizer in 1W1 Porcelain. Which is a little dark for me. It's a little orangey for me. But, whatever. I'm going to try to use it up. I mean, it's a tinted moisturizer, so I could probably use it up pretty fast. And since this only probably going to be 10 to 15, I'm probably not going to focus in on this. I'm probably going to try to do, like, a couple every month, but I'm not going to be, like, just bum-rushing it. <laughs> like, be like, just use this! Because, like, this is good for, like, lighter coverage days or whatever, because sometimes I just want that. So, and especially since it's, like, summertime now, and, the, yeah, yesterday was, like, 90-something. Yesterday was, like, burning hot for some reason but i don't know chicago is always weird like chicago just has the weirdest weather but 
Yeah, but I'm going to mock every time I use this. Because I'm probably not going to use it a lot each month. Like, probably only two or three times each month. Unless if I, like, somehow get behind and I'm like, got to use this a lot now. But, yeah. So, I'm going to try to use this little guy up. I mean, it's not that big. But also, I know these things last forever. Like, if I cut this much concealer, if this was concealer, it would take me probably a year to finish. <laughs> because, like, foundations and concealers just last me so long. I use so little of them, especially concealers. Like, concealers, I use, like, a pinhead size amount. <laughs> and I don't even wear concealer all the time that I wear makeup, so... But face products just take forever for me. So, yeah. But those are all the products. Um, I'm really excited to see what other people pick. And see how they just, uh, do these things. And I'm really excited to see what other people pick for Pluto. That, that, that are doing the Pluto. Because I know, like, I saw at least three other comments that was the do Pluto too. So, I'm, like, really excited. Like, so, yeah. So, I'm just to uh, say bye, I guess. I don't know. I don't know how to end videos because <laughs> I'm awkward <laughs> but yeah okay so I hope you guys liked this video and stay tuned for like other project pan things because I'm doing like a bazillion right now I'm doing wait one two three four I, I am doing like four well I'm doing five technically but one is ending very soon so one only has like one more month left so Technically, I'm doing five, but, like, it's really only four because one is ending so soon. But, yeah, so if you like Project Pans, you can, like, watch them. And I'm doing a Pan That Palette, which I'm doing pretty good on. I'm pretty happy with my progress with my Pan That Palette. So, if you want to watch, if you like all that stuff, you can subscribe and see and watch my things. I'm not good at making videos, though, so I'm going to be an awkward potato during it. But, if you like it, you like it. Please leave a comment because I love reading the comments and bye. <laughs> See you in another video.